Despite years of progress, Asia and the Pacific still faces interconnected development challenges, especially its low-income communities. Access to finance is still limited. Housing is unaffordable and environmentally unsustainable. And the climate crisis makes these issues worse, particularly in needy and remote communities. Bamboo, the woody grass that is abundant in the Philippines and across Asia and the Pacific, offers game-changing solutions to these challenges. Beyond its use as a garden plant for low-priced furniture and as a source of food in many Asian households, bamboo has the potential to transform access to finance, housing, and sustainability. Countries across Asia Pacific, including countries like the Philippines, are every year hit by natural hazards. And time and again, it is the poorest communities that are most affected. In searching for a sustainable solution, we came across the remarkable potential of bamboo. The real breakthrough came when we realized that when planting, bamboo plants were being geotagged. This opened up a whole new dimension, data. The such data can enhance risk management, create investment opportunities, and an environment where bamboo can be valued for its environmental impact and economic potential. Bamboo's strength and versatility make it an ideal material for affordable and sustainable housing and other goods. When treated and processed, it can also be engineered into durable building materials comparable to steel. Bamboo's fast growth rate means it can capture and store significant amounts of carbon dioxide. And when grown over large areas, bamboo forests contribute to water conservation watershed protection and landslide prevention. And by integrating modern technologies into bamboo, it can become a valuable financial asset. By combining data from geotagged and geocoded bamboo with geospatial technology and AI, an alternative credit scoring system can be developed for bamboo farmers, most of whom are unbanked and have no prior credit history. On the other hand, financial institutions can consider detailed geospatial assessments of a bamboo plantation's value as collateral for issuing loans. Ang nakita na mo sa uh, bambo, pag to uminga ka na, ma-present ko lang atong kinayahan. O kini, ma-benefits kini sa mga uli na to kita o sa mga sumusunod pa. The thriving bamboo industry in the Philippines demonstrates its viability and scalability while engaging with local communities and indigenous peoples. The bamboo value chain involves a lot of partners, and one of the key important partners is the indigenous people because they have the land in their ancestral domain. One of the things that we're doing is helping the IPs steward their land by sustainably growing bamboos that will lead to intergenerational wealth and intergenerational opportunities. Rhizome, one of the bamboo manufacturing companies in the Philippines, shows that harnessing bamboo's potential can yield social and environmental benefits. Bamboo is a super fiber, but it also has miraculous properties. It's as strong like steel, it has the toughness of concrete that allow us to turn it into uh, structural building materials like this beam. And if we converted about 20% of the built environment with regenerative bamboo materials, we would reduce the carbon footprint of the, of the industry by over 30%. With the world's bamboo market growing, now is the time to leverage the industry's potential as a financial tool while supporting local communities and promoting climate action across Asia and the Pacific. Organizations like the Asian Development Bank can play a crucial role in this journey. We can help support governments establish bamboo value chains, we can help ensure that the right environment is in place for private sector to scale bamboo supply chains, and most importantly, we can help empower local communities, including indigenous people whose land and knowledge are at the heart of bamboo cultivation. Join us in exploring the endless possibilities of bamboo to transform finance, housing, and the environment. And let's work together for a prosperous, inclusive, resilient, and sustainable Asia and the Pacific.